So, good morning everyone. Right now, I am considering going to the paintball station game. However, there is kind of one thing. Paintball station has a lot of long range and I've never quite had the range on my gun to really make proper use of it. So, I'm going to be doing a bit of an upgrade. I've had this, I think it's called an M120 spring for like ages now. And I've never actually put it in my gun and had it work. But with the upgraded high torque motor, I'm thinking that I may be able to run it. So I'm going to try and swap out everything inside the gun and see how it works. <laughs> I have everything reassembled. Now, the real test here is to see if the motor inside the grip here is going actually going to be strong enough to pull the springs. It shoots! So, with the gun upgrades done, I took an hour and a half drive up to Jericho Day Zero event hosted at Paintball Station. After a virus wiped out most of humanity, the immune survivors grouped together to forge a militia in the small town of Jericho. Soon thereafter, the government sent out hostile soldiers to invade our town. We don't know why, but we do know it's our job to take back our town. Airdrops have fallen from the sky. We've made it our mission to collect those resources. Going left? Forward, got it. The first mission of the day didn't go entirely too well, at least for me. P-Stars and Snipers in the cross section of the map made early first missions difficult to push through and I often found myself getting pegged when I thought I was out of range or in proper enough cover. I did manage to snag one kill here though. See him. Really, motherfucker? <laughs> okay. Stop and shoot him. With the supplies secured, <clears throat> sorry, rough voice. With the supplies secured, we've made it our goal to establish a hospital for our wounded to get them back in the fight. Throw it and let it roll. There you go. Good job. Keep it going. Keep it going. Weave it around the front. Yo. Hey, don't go in front. Weave it around the front of it. Here, I attempt to push along this upper flank here, but I'm continually shot due to the lack of proper cover on this upper flank. But the hospital, as an additional respawn point, made fighting in this city immensely more enjoyable because getting plinked from what feels like a mile away 
doesn't mean taking close to a five minute respawn. Yeah, I'm not joking when I say five minutes. The original respawn point takes bang, roughly bang. two minutes to walk back to, okay. well, and easily three minutes before the necessary three other people required to respawn arrive at the respawn point. And that's why it was a fun relief when I could get back into the fight without enduring that lengthy trek, and also why I encourage the organizers for future events to experiment with other respawn points that aren't necessarily behind the lake. Woo! Got one! Eventually, my team starts to push up onto the cross-section towers of the field and begin to take back Jericho from government forces through a gap in their forward operating base's defense. He's, he's by the box with the... Yo, I'm just trying to get closer and like push up to that box there, yeah. Okay, yep, got one. Well, okay, so it's looking like you're technically allowed to like run through here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Well then. What happens if you push right? Is there a lot of people covering the right side there? What's underneath it? We own Tower 3, so it's a tower across the way that we need to breach, right? Government forces still do have control of the back towers, however, and we're attempting to seize them. I get it. Okay. There's a tower farther behind that close one there. I'm willing to bet that's where they're coming from. Oh, okay. It's Tower 6. It's Tower 6. It's directly across like this. After securing the hospital, the policemen, doctor, and governor have risen in our ranks, and we must defend them from being captured at all costs, as they are valuable to re-establishing Jericho into a working city. No biz. Yo, hey, think I can bound from there? Yep, I'm moving up. Whew, yeah. That's coming from the tower. Slide tower thing. Oh, I would not get up, are you? I also don't know if this guy's tooth Ooh, got shot out or if he's just spitting or what. Um, yeah, I hope he was all right. I'm gonna try for that. I right don't now. actually have anywhere else to go with this, so I don't know why I'm still we'll talking. Moving on. Pushing up right, bad idea or good idea? Uh, YOLO, right? Oh yep, you're dead, okay.
Oh, that was next to my ear. Thanks to that spring upgrade, I'm also able to reach out and touch quite a few more targets than I would normally be able to. Like here. Oh, sorry. Hopefully this guy feeds. All right, looking like it. Stop shooting tower four! Four! Friendly! Friendly four! Friendly four! Yeah, they're not pushing up. They're not pushing up through the city nearly as hard. They gotta be pushing through the woods right now. Dark? Dark? Dark and tower! Yeah. Hey, they're flanking. They're gonna be flanking from the left side. Hey, I'm seeing them cross! Hey, guys, they're crossing left! I just got a sniper's attention. Come back down. Oh, sh. The tent hole? Yeah. I'm surprised I'm not shot by now, but. Was I shooting at the right tent? Yeah, I'm seeing a move. Did we touch that sniper? He tucked back. I'm pretty yeah. sure we were an alien. Yeah, well, he's depressed then. I right, see him way, tucked way back in there. Shit. And that's the last of my ammo. And with that, against all odds, our militia forces have secured Jericho. But that's not the end. Government forces will return. Jericho's militia must remain ever vigilant. So it's looking like the game day is pretty much over here at Paintball Station. It's a bit of a trek for me, so don't expect me going here all too often. But when I do, I will try and bring the camera along and get some footage for you guys. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed watching that. Make sure to stay subscribed for all the future airsoft videos that are coming up very, very soon here. I'm Isaiah. Have a great day and peace.